It's time. She's finally here. Took them long enough to get Asuna her god account ready. But it is indeed Stacia. Vasago, so close to just doing Roni dirty. But honestly, again, Roni and TC, they only exist for one reason. And you know, I don't have to say it again for you to understand what I'm saying. And then Stacia shows up. And this powers. It's unlimited, right? But because like we have a reason for her to just be OP, but I wonder exactly what the limit of what Asuna's powers are. And Vasika remembers that face. It must be back in Aincrad, KOB, Knights of Blood, right? Vice Captain, The Flash, Yuki. It's going to be so hype. But again, with Stacia coming in, she can just change the map however she wants. It's create holes, everything to fall underneath. But there's got to be a limit or it's going to be too OP. Let's find out in today's reaction. Took these dudes long enough. Asna, unit ID SA001. So, this is the difference. Vasago and Mr. Miller already link started at this point. But because we talked here, that's what caused the delay of her showing up late. I can reason with that. I can for sure do mental gymnastics and say that, yeah. This little section here when they're talking, it caused Asuna to show up late to the war. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. Unlimited landscape alteration. Literally creative mode. You can do whatever you want. Okay. Okay, so this is the limiting factor, some sort of like nerf, right? Because it's so demanding on your flux light to just go creative mode. You can't use it too much. Headache. What happens if she continues to do it for Kirito? Uh oh, that's gonna be bad for us now. Link start. Opening. No opening? This shows up with like some kind of northern lights, man. Yokuso. Stacia, the goddess of creation. Uh oh, the head attack. The head attacks. Oh. Kiga didn't really say what would happen beyond the headache. He said, if, you, if your head starts hurting, just don't do it too much. What happens if we force ourselves? Like, what really happens? Asuna has to roleplay now. Just like how Mr. Miller did the whole roleplay speech, Asuna needs to roleplay as God now. You're breaking the immersion! あなたは奇跡を起こして、じゃあ修道士さんたち。それに、キリトはい。No Wait, he's moving! Holy sh- Holy shit, he's reacting. Holy! Okay, the sense of ego, right? That self. Will it get restored because Asuna is here? And Asuna should be able to just create an arm for him, right? He sh should. Assume Outside world. Did, does Roni and Tisei know that Kirito's from the out, outside world? Anyways, we leaked that. Divine. Sure. Sure, whatever you say. Oh no, Asuna, stop. You can't. Asuna, what are you doing? You go make all of these characters fucking glitch out if you fucking confront them with reality. Okay. How far is she gonna go with this? The truth. Oh, 
私に任せて。ん、I don't think this arc is gonna get resolved purely with Stacia showing up. Nah. Kirito needs to have that ego filled back in. He needs to wake up from this slumber. Asuna will use creative mode to get his arm back. Dual wield blue rose with night sky blade. Golden eye Kirito. That's what I'm expecting to solve this arc. <laughs> Lost Alice says, Who the fuck you think you are? I'm sorry, Alice. You're a new girl in season three. Alice has been there since season one. <laughs> the waifus are fighting. I'm his wife? Girlfriend? Also. Isn't this kind of crazy that Alice is literally fucking competing with Asuna right now on her god account? Mm. <laughs> 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 Oji-sama so cool! Yep, confirmed. Oji-sama stronger than Stacia, confirmed. Cause Stacia plus Alicia was no match for Berkeley there. <laughs> Why do you say that, Berkeley? Stacia helped? But what happened here? We didn't see this specifically, right? <laughs> That's so hype. Every time Asta does something, terraforming, bro. Fucking, I don't know if this is the Northern Lights, but it looks like the Northern Lights. And you have the fucking choir coming in. ダイチが幅100メルも下げた。ダイオン。差し物検討主練中も飛び越えられるところだった俺たちは。この女さんが救ってくれたのは間違いない。女患者でも。She's <笑> She would be if she actually assumed that role. I mean, she says she's not a goddess. So, you know? Yeah, she is. Yeah. But Quinella's evil Asuna. Asuna's too nice. She wouldn't do that to Alice. That's rough. But I have hacks. What? How much is she gonna tell them? Yeah, I mean, she has to tell them that she's not the one who did it. Yeah, so that's it. Okay, so if you decide that, that's it. See, Tisa and Roni have more than one purpose, rather than getting assaulted. To get the tea for the grown-ups. Honestly, as much as I shit on Tisa and Roni, they are putting in more work than Volo could ever. What the fuck happened to Volo, man? I'm just disappointed. He should be in the front lines along with Lina Senpai and, you know, Yuji Sensei as well. Oh my god, the waifu wars over Kirito, bro. It is happening. This is such a cute slice of life music right now. <laughs> Alice? And, bro, that little hood there. <laughs> now, this is peak competition over Kirito. <sighs> Roni, you gonna try to compete? I know, I know you're Kirito's page. Roni kind of was for Kirito, but like, I... You're like, Roni... It's like a Squirtle. And there's a fucking Charizard and like a Venusaur fighting right now. Roni can't get in there. Ro nah, no, it's, it's, Roni's She's not even in the race right now. <laughs>。私の先輩。なんだ。皆さん、始めまして。私の名前はアスナ。この世界の外側からやってきます。この世界、アンダーワールドと。Wait. Aren't they gonna like have a mental breakdown? Like, I thought their floodlights couldn't comprehend the shock 
that they are a simulation and there's a real world out there and they would all fucking lose it. But damn, Asuna just straight up telling them. あなたはこの世界を支配するためにやって来られたのですかその逆です。私の目としてそんな馬鹿のそもそも外の世界って同じことそう they're not completely aware of what the real world or outside world is. Like, we told them, but they're not really understanding. Now we gotta tell them, you're not real humans. You're all just data input output. And uh, I'm sorry, you're all gonna get wiped after this round. Okay. Berkeley making sure no one goes through a panic attack. Nah, fuck the outside world. Who cares, man? Your soul will be so sweet. あまり時間はありません。アンダーワールドの消滅を防ぐには、アリスさんが私と一緒にもアリスさんが存在しないと知れば、敵はこの世界への干渉をやめるはず。Just eject Alice. Oh yeah, yeah, we have been in battle for a long time. You, it's like episode 9 or some shit right now, and you finally fucking shown up, bitch. Mm -hmm. I am really surprised how just calmly Berkeley's assessing this, even just like saying no doubt be a human from the real world like you, like, he just so chill about this thing maybe he's panicking but like if the leader is able to keep the people underneath you know in check by him acting cool and calm then everyone else will also follow suit so berkeley great leader mm -hmm. and that's one of the stupidest things because like when they were trying to log in all the different accounts were fucking locked out but only the super accounts had no security it's just like what now, I prefer it like this. Do you want them to show up and, you know, lose her account? No. Him, Mr. Miller being a Dark Lord Vector and Asuna having Stacia, it's hype. But if you think about, like, <laughs> how this came to be, it's one of those, like, inconsistencies or, like, little plot holes from the writing of SAO author. I'm, I'm fine with it. It's perfectly fine, but it's just funny to think about. What's up, Renly? What's the Priestess of Light? <laughs> it's a bullshit title. We just need Alice. Her Flutlight is special. How do we explain to Renly that, like, beyond this concept of a flux light that's gonna be implanted into multiple mass produced robots for AI warfare, there's also this guy that can fucking eat the souls and say, Your soul will be so sweet, and he wants Alice because of Alicia. I don't know. 871. Shaco! Shaco talking! <laughs> Every time Shaita says something, it's like, what the fuck? I love Shaita though. Honestly, Shaita might be one of my favorite Integrity Knights. She is so funny to me. Your eye, your right eye starts getting triggered, right? And Alice overcame it, Yuji overcame it. Yeah, we overcame that. Imposed by that person, which I'm assuming is Kikoka or someone within Wrath. Asa, do you remember anything? 
Like, it's either Kikoka or that guy. Remember? Remember that one time, that one scene where Asuna passes a dude with a fucking rat tail in the corridors? He was suspicious because one of the four people who was, I think, Dark God Vecta in the lore in the origin stories, there was another dude with that rat tail as Vecta, right? So again, like, there's something special about that guy we haven't seen yet. And maybe that dude is also the one that leaked to NSA and USA. No, no, no. Wasn't there someone on JDS Japanese SDF force that leaked? I forget. But that, that character with the rat tail, probably super important. People that could like break that shit. A1 pictures could have done Asuna more dirty here if they went a little lower. Mm -hmm. A means of sabotage? I thought it was an intentional system to test people to their limits and see if they could break it. Like, of course, I, I thought the whole point of the right seal was like, oh, you're getting close to, you know, breaking the Taibo Index. That's kind of bad. But Kikoka wanted people that was capable of breaking such things. I thought that made sense, but suddenly, it's a means of sabotage. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume it's the rat tail guy. The rat tail guy is the mole, in my opinion. There's no one else. I've been focusing so hard on the story, there's no one else that's been sus as that rat tail guy and because he was also one of the four origin dude that introduced sin of this world it's gotta be him right <laughs> this is when kikoka says since when were you under the impression that i was on wrath pull some eyes and shit it was kikoka at the end of the day he was the sabotage <laughs> oh Kirito's speaking. <laughs> that's like Kirito's first couple words in season four. I don't think he's actually had a fucking single voice voice line until now, right? I don't think he has. He's finally spoken season four. Hmm. We got a spy. We got a rat. I mean, if we have a rat and that guy has a rat tail, isn't that even more condemning? Nah, that's a silly coincidence. Unless the author is trying to fucking say something. つまり、アスナ嬢ちゃんの言う well, there's a little bit more than just to seal the right eye, right? But yeah, it is an important differentiating factor right now. Because she's special. I don't know why she's special. Ikoko always said that she's special. Project Alice. Arisization. Alice in another world, right? That, that whole lore as well. Do we have enough hints to understand why she's special? Because like Yuji was also able to, you know, break apart the fucking seal and break it. I don't think that's the reason Alice is special. The sacred resources, that's kind of interesting. But it's not just, you know, Alice that overcame the right eye. Like, Yuji did the same shit. Doesn't that mean Yuji is also special? I'm not sure. I thought that because... Alice was the one gathering all these sacred resources that maybe this is supposed to be something special. But no, I thought that she was special in a conceptual way because she was... Honestly, I don't know. Because plenty of people before broke the fucking taboo index as well, right? I know Yuji was dead. Well, he's kind of in the sword right now, but they're still special, right? And you would think that Kikoka would have said, like, you know, it's not just Alice that's special. Maybe Yuji was special too before in Season 3. But regardless, maybe it just has to do with breaking the right CLI, and if you can do that, obviously, we can take that shit out and fucking implement the soul into different AI bots that can kill because we're trying to mass-produce soldiers for war. Oh, you got no clue. So, my understanding was that every uh, Integrity Knight has also broken the Taboo Index. 
And because Alice's synthesis is 30, I thought that, like, she wasn't the first. But that may not be true. And in fact, Alice may be one of the first knights to ever break the taboo index, even though she's a 30th one, and all the previous ones were just scouted by Pontifex. And in that case, she could be special because she was the first person to break the taboo index. Maybe. Who knows? But breaking taboo index does not equal breaking seal of eye? Does it not? Well, it doesn't. Because when she broke the taboo index, her eye didn't explode. Her eye exploded when she was with Kirito near the end of season 3 and we were climbing and we confronted her of the realities and the memories, right? So that is an important part to differentiate. Grass is always greener on the other side. Yeah, like, our friends, right? Like, imagine Alice popping up in ALO, right? That'd be kind of cool to hang out with, like, Alice in ALO. With, you know, with Eagle in the background not saying anything. But, Kikoka definitely doesn't see Alice like that. No, Kikoka sees them as literal fucking tools. As mass weapons of destruction, that's it. Uh-oh. Are you ready for some English dub? I have questions, but mm. they can wait until later. It's not bad. Hold on, hold on. Let's hear. No paradise either. Not even close. Yeah. Compared to here, it's not as tranquil. But still, Dirty. there are good things about my world. You, but there's more who'd want to protect this. Yeah, there's some that's gonna exploit for sure, like Ikoka. But we have like Silica, you know. The dub is actually really good. The dub is genuinely good here from Asuna. I don't find it cringe at all. You can feel the intent of her emotions. I want to protect this world, just like Kirito. And she even said Kirito like in a Japanese way, instead of saying Kirito or some shit, right? Like, instead of saying Naruto, Naruto, but like an English dub person saying it, like, she's super sweaty. So, Kirito -kun no yoni. Mm hmm. まずは目の前の敵を打ち破って外の世界云々はそれからです。え、暗黒神ベクタがリアルワールドの舞台を離れるのは危険かもしれないから。私も皆さんと一緒に戦います。Once or twice more. Okay, we don't have that much left. So is Vasako just dead? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Because last episode, the hole opened up underneath Vasako and he fell down. Is he just done? I'm just realizing they hyped this guy up. There's no way he's done like that. No, I don't want it to be done already, but I'm like, shit, there's no way he's already out. That would suck. Oh, she just called Asuna an isekai gym, bro. Guys. SAO is Isekai. Alice literally said Isekai Jin, otherworlder person. Isekai, otherworld. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Renly. The whole thing of Asuna not being a god, while that may be true, she does have a god account. And you can't just do that shit, but yeah, I get what you're trying to say. Let's go, Shaker! Yo, where the fuck did Lina Senpai go? This dude is dominating recently. I, I appreciate Yuji's, you know, master, you know, popping up. Where the fuck is Lina Senpai? We see her once after her sitting on the goddamn chair before the war? The rat tail guy. Oh, what the fuck? She can just change outfits like that? Alright, got account privileges. Yeah. あなたが知っているキリトに関するすべてを私に教えなさい。長くなるわよ。一晩じゃ終わらないかも。The right. <laughs> slice of life cute soundtrack is playing. This is going to be great. と、相棒として戦ったのが2年間。And yeah. then married, dated. お付き合いが1年半。Dated. <laughs> Tell her we have a daughter. Tell her we have a daughter named Yui on top of that. Oh nice. You know what, that, that part is, you know, she did take care of us. She literally was our caretaker for six months. That that has to count for something. 
そう、うん、あの<笑>先輩のお部屋を掃除して<笑>あと、ケッ !Look at her little hat!Look at Roni have!Dude, s a o slice of life moments are actually so god tier! 先輩も何度かごちそうしていただきましたお二人と比べると期間はだいぶ短いですけど、yeah. !Way to goddamn cute!Let's go, Roni! <笑>いいわよあなたもお仲間ってわけね情報交換、oh. 私も加えても Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-senpai!Lina-